Hi all, welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, we are going to learn about why a demand curve slopes downwards. This is mostly repeated question for 5 marks and it is very important question. So, why so, is the demand curve downward slope? See, demand always depends on price. If price and the cut increase out there, demand decreases and if price decreases, demand increases. There is an inverse relation between demand and price. This is the intro which you know to give and you need to even understand this. Okay, price increase out there, automatically demand decrease out there. Price decrease out there, demand increase out there. What are the reasons for downward or negative slope of demand curve? There are five main reasons. First one is old and new buyers. If the price of a good falls, the real income of old buyers will increase and they will buy more. Not only old buyers, new buyers also start buying that good. This is the first reason. The second one is income effect. Whenever the price falls, the consumer will think to buy same commodity for more quantity because of small saving in the budget. These days, we are having a small saving in the budget. If you a small price, we will definitely take it because of the small saving in the budget. Right. The, coming to the next one is substitution effect. When the price of a commodity falls, it becomes cheaper than it substitutes. For example, if price of close-up toothpaste decreases, its demand may increase relatively more than Colgate toothpaste. For example, okay, close-up toothpaste, Colgate toothpaste. Undi. Close up toothpaste value sadanga oka koncham value taggin and kundi then demand automatically peripotundi. Then to compare this say coal get toothpaste to compare this. So this is all about the substitution effect. Going to the next reason that is multiple uses of a commodity. Multiple uses and different different uses. Chala rakalgan. So there are some commodities which have multiple uses like sugar, milk, coal, electricity. So, if their price falls, there will be greater demand to use them for other purposes. If you milk value is not for example, then you can use milk for example, milk for example, there will be greater demand to use them for other purposes. If you use value, there will be greater demand to use them for other purposes. This is the exact meaning of multiple uses of a commodity. Coming to the next reason, Law of diminishing marginal utility. We have done a video about it also. But also, this is also one of the reasons why the demand curve slopes down. According to this law, whenever the additional utility diminishes, when we use a product again and again. Yes? So, when that product price falls, the consumer will pay less for that product to buy additional units. Due to this reason, the demand curve slopes downwards from left to right. So, this is all about the reasons why a demand curve slopes downwards. I hope you all understood it. If you want more informative videos like this, like, share and subscribe my channel. Thank you.